Hi everybody. Yes, this is a little surprise, a little surprise visit because I got a box of goodies this morning and it kind of shocked me how much I'd ordered for myself. <laughs> Oops. But no, I needed a kind of a refresh. I needed a few different things and um, some of you guys have been so kind um, sending PayPal gifts to me. So I need to spend the money. You know, that's what you send it to me for. So, you know, it's got to be spent. So I thought I'd show you, I, there were some items that came for customers, um, I've already put those in bags ready to go and to be honest most of them I think you've seen me seen before so um, I'm not going to show you those. Right, hello everybody, yes uh, if you're watching this on the replay um, I just popped on live while I had a few minutes while I was unpacking things before they go on the shelf so I thought I'd just jump in on here. So good morning, hello Miss Janine, hi Martina, hi Tina. <sighs> I surprised you, did I? Um, so those of you who are wondering how on earth do you get to jump on the lives immediately, uh, please email me, ruthtrice at gmail.com, if you want to be added to my WhatsApp notification broadcast list. Basically, uh, it, it means you just email me with your phone number, your cell phone number, uh, with your country's code. Okay, I do know the American one. I might not know many others. American Canada, rather that's easy um but yeah so basically i don't share your mobile phone with anybody else unless you give me permission to i just have it stored on my phone so i can send you a message that is it right you have a few minutes too excellent martina good 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 let's see if you approve of my purchases so let's have a look at the desk so got, got them all here ready I do have some dies to unravel. Okay, so this is, I think, the only letters alphabet set that we have in the current offering. So I just wanted to have a little play with it. I do like the font, although it's all lowercase, which can sometimes be, but we'll, we'll work with it. There's also a punch to match. So this punch will fit all these letters inside that little shape which is kind of cute actually and it's like a mini version of i was just going to say it's a mini version of this one so that that teamed up with that would look really nice together just realized that good old stamping up and their um coordination and all that and it also has letters with umlauts and caps and uh, what are these called the dots and blah blahs so um if you need that kind of thing that it's all there uh we've also got dollars we have euros so this would be helpful if you if you've got a stall and you're maybe selling cards and you need um signs for um money also have got numbers there that's really handy i don't spot if we have just a dot on its own hmm may have to do some stamp surgery yeah but you know we, we can work through that one I'm sure we, we'll figure that one out I, I'm not averse to stamp surgery as you guys know all right so that's that one then we have pure magic because we my my household is full of kids who love kind of mythology and stuff and I love seeing the Pegasus. I'm a bit of a Narnia fan, so the Pegasus is going to go great because there's, there's a Pegasus in Narnia. There's also a dragon in Narnia. There's also mermaids in Narnia as well. So there we go. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, I might use have a legendary birthday because my sons are into D. Actually, well, mm, two sons and a daughter are into D D Dungeons and Dragons. So this will go well. Now this one, I it was a toss up between this one and the medallion one. I do want to get the medallion one. Um, no unicorn, no. Um, I guess you could take the wings off and put a horn on it, but no. It, it was actually quite nice to see n have a Pegasus rather than a unicorn. Yeah, different, different mythical being. Yeah. Uh, this one. Now, when I first looked at it, I was slightly put off having the words there. I'm wondering whether or not I can do some stamp surgery to that. But regardless, 
just using I think the floral that that section there is is super handy and I, I, yeah I've got some ideas for this one mixing that with maybe that to make a famous uh, designer handbag yeah I was talking to some ladies in my zoom class last night about that right now this one has dies to match I hope it's these ones chic dies I use the papers ouch clip his wings yeah I don't think you do unic unicorns don't have wings I, I know sometimes they are depicted I mean my little pony unicorns have wings but mm, yeah I don't know what kind of mythical creatures they are oh look at this oh grungy 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 love here look at that so we have some dies that will cut out the stamps we also have oh, snowflakes love a snowflake i've got a, i've got a snowflake punch sitting here that's contraband um look but that's not yeah that's pretty cool i like that um, yeah i've got various snowflake punches from throughout the years and yeah so two snowflakes in different sizes and possibly those could be snowflakes as well or they could be stamens they could be the inside of the flowers and look at this fabulous grungy um oh, i've just ripped it ripped the card grungy kind of texture there that would make a great stencil to cut that out and use as a stencil i might try cutting that out with some uh, plastic so that we can do that that is cool um yeah some great things there looking forward to having a play with that one put that to one side now i succumbed a few of you've got this one and i've just seen some lovely cards with it it also i just needed some more kind of medium-sized flowers so yeah and it's got some little tiny little flowers there love the sentiments and, and the sending because it also has a die to match and i think you can cut out the word sending really big oh good susan yeah i have to say you kind of enabled me with that one in more ways than one yeah <laughs> Janine just gave them a passing glance. Oh, I oh know. Yeah, we often do that with these. So there we go. We've got the massive sending there and then various dies that will cut out. Now, I actually got this at, a, at half price because my order went over £400. So um, that's why I, I bought this one. Ooh. Oh, hold on. Yeah, don't make the mistake of trying to match dies to the images on the cover of your case because these are often a bit smaller it's this side this is the true size here so there we go that's that's brilliant that fits those and great if you don't want a fussy cut i know some of you are a bit fussy cut you know averse <laughs> so that's a good one cute little tiny flowers didn't realize those were in there that's nice and then you've got the shadow of sending that's great love that then a fish and a wish uh tom was asking actually for another kind of slightly more spiritual stamp set and the loving love never fails i thought was good and then also the fish symbol is kind of a um, traditionally historic Christian symbol so I thought that would be good I like this leafy thing here and the texture as well so I'm going to give this one to Tom to have a little play with you're on the fence yeah I was on the fence too Inika. yeah I was on the fence too oh sorry another die now I managed to snag this as part of celebration so I got this for free because Stampin' Up! added extra items to the celebration offering. And so I, I did a massive restock of card to card. So hence my order was quite big. Um, I'm not going to show you the card stock. You know what card stock looks like. But I managed to get this one. 
Now, normally this is thirty pounds. I think it's quite it's quite expensive, but look at it. Mm, I can cut my own stencils with that. Make really interesting backgrounds. Cut lots of circles in one go. <laughs> yeah, that's fun. Yeah, I'm gonna have fun with that. Okay, so last thing to show you is this paper. Out of this sweet, I mean, I do like the holly leaves, but I, I wasn't convinced I would use use them. I, I may still get them, but it, it's just on top of my list right now. But the papers were, because I felt that the, the papers had kind of, um, you know, lots of options with it. They can be backgrounds and then also you can cut out elements from them. So you've got this, oh, so you've got the Ponsettia with the lovely... Just a mottled background there then these can be cut out which I thought would be handy and then a uh, oh that's a kind of bark texture that's fun so that's a nice contrast to the flowers there and then what have we got here trees and a mottled green again great color contrast there then here we have holly which could be cut out individually with another texture quite grungy then more ponsettias and oh look at that oh that's given me an idea like that Ponce oh, i'll leave that bit of way around so i can see so that's got polka dots on it and those are kind of polka dots that don't make your eyes go crazy. Sometimes there's certain polka dots that make my eyes go a bit weird. But for some reason, this one doesn't too much. Oh, I like that. That's very me, isn't it? Those layers of colour and then you've got white in there as well. Yeah, I like that. Might try and recreate that, actually. And then this one. Oh, this is like Christmas camo. <laughs> Christmas camouflage guys yes try and hide yourself in the front room with this on can you imagine that in I can imagine this is pajamas okay right ah right so guys who come to my you ladies and gentlemen are welcome to who come to my local card classes you may be seeing this in a in a workshop soon so there we go so let me know what your faves are I also have got to, I'm a bit behind with filming my monthly thank you videos. So you may see me use one, one of these, two of these in that. Uh, please, yeah, let me know what you think of what I've purchased. I have the paper, but I did not like the stamp set. Is that for the Holly one? Yeah, I like the stamp set. I just thought that the Holly was quite large. And I would have really appreciated, thank you, Bobby. Mwah. Um, I would have appreciated like a Ponsettia because we lost the Ponsettia in the last catalogue, the annual. And I just felt it would have been nice to have one to, to be able to stamp. But hey, hey. Um, uh, but I guess if they bought another Ponsettia, people would have gone, oh, we had a Ponsettia last year. <laughs> you can't win. You can't win. <laughs> Right, uh, any other comments? Tiny circles for a shaker card. Oh, yes, if you cut it out of glimmer paper. I've got a class next Tuesday, Louise. Yeah, class next Tuesday at 10, 10 till 12.30. 10.30 till 12.30. Oh, I don't know. Something like that. 10 till 12.30, that's it. Yeah, next Tuesday. But get better first, Miss Louise. You cannot cut thick enough plastic for stencils with dyes. Ask me how I do know. Oh, okay. Maybe just do it out of paper then. All right. Um, sensing hugs. Oh, sending hugs is still out of stock, my friend. is. Oh, so in America, sending hugs is out of stock. Okay. So this is the 7th of September. So if you're watching this in a month's time, things may have changed. All right, is there any other questions? Because I've got to go. Tom's just poked his head around the door to say lunch is ready, so I'm going to go. Oh, yes, fly on a Pegasus. I'll send you a Pegasus, Bobby. You can hop on and fly in for a class. It'd be lovely to see you. Yeah. No. 
That's the, I often say um, when when the mini comes out, whatever mini it is, the um, the what we kind of call the spring mini or the winter mini, autumn, winter, spring, summer mini. If um, I have lots, obviously, I clearly have lots of Stampin' Up! demo friends, uh, people in my team. And when they go, oh, there wasn't in there that I, I like, you know, wasn't much I liked. I went, that's, that's not a bad thing. <laughs> that's not terrible. Save you some pennies. Just use the stuff you love, you know. So there we go. Oh, Louise, you're more than welcome. Let me know. Let me know. Right, my lovelies. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Lovely to see your uh, your impressions of what I've purchased, and uh, I look forward to playing and showing you some things with it. So um, yeah, take care for now. Hi Lisa, I hope you're feeling better. You weren't so great as well, were you? There we go. All right, lots of love, everyone. God bless. Bye. Oh, don't know where to get out now. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe.